We continue to look ahead to the 22 season, and on today's video, we'll look at five of the top NAIA receivers who are returning. We start with information that had to make fans in Orange City very happy, the news that Cade Mosier is returning for one more year with the Red Raiders. Mosier, a second-team All-American, was second in the NAIA in 2021 in both total receiving yards at 1504 and receiving touchdowns, 21. Northwestern went 12-2 last season and made another deep run into the playoffs, another national semifinal appearance with a strong performance by Mosier who picked up 18.6 yards per catch. James Dixon earned an honorable mention All-American nod following his debut season with Bethel. The Wildcats receiver gained an impressive 20.7 yards per catch, third best in the nation, and was in the top eight in total receiving yards at 11-16. Dixon had 14 touchdowns for the Wildcats in 21 and could play a big role in 22 to build on a seven-win season for Bethel last year. In Judson's inaugural football season, Ovante Vickers made opponents' defenses recognize his presence. Vickers was in the top five in the country with 7.2 receptions per game and recorded 1,103 total receiving yards for the year. He averaged 14 yards per catch and turned in a season in which he was recognized as the first NAIA All-American in program history as an honorable mention. He was also named an NCCAA All-American, and with him returning, the Eagles have a solid piece in place for their second year in 22. Bluefield's quarterback, Nathan Herstich, was recognized in an earlier video as one of the top returning quarterbacks, and he'll have a great target to find again this season as Jaquan Ebron returns for the Rams in 2022. The first-team All-American is a two-sport athlete at Bluefield, competing for the Rams in not only football, but also in indoor track and field in the high jump. Ebron had the second most receiving yards per game in the NAI at 127.8, which is tops among returnees. His 1,406 total receiving yards was third most in the nation as well to go with 16 TD catches. Caleb Tannis led the way for Mid-American Nazarene's offense last season and is back for another year in Olathe. The second team All-American hauled in an NAIA best 22 receiving touchdowns last season. Tannis had eight 100-plus yard receiving games, scored a touchdown in all but one game last year for the Pioneers, and brought in four touchdown catches twice. He averaged 125.5 receiving yards per game and 17.2 yards per catch. Thanks for watching this video and Midwest Sports Net. Please take a moment to like the video and subscribe to the channel where we talk small college sports and more throughout the Midwest and beyond.